Hey everybody. Happy New Year. Happy, happy New Year. First vlog of 2020 and our vision is freaking clear. <laughs> Very clear actually. Um, it's been a while since we've been on here it seems like. Yeah we had a couple of guests. We went to Wildfire Retix. Yep and then we had our friend Jake who helped us figure out how to do all of the wiring in the bus. And we got some tips and some 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 updates yes that we will tell you about as we go for sure but we wanted to jump on here because first of all it's the beginning of a new year yeah and we have some big changes that have just happened and we want to share them with you so yesterday was my last day as a w2 employee period uh we now permanently live in the bus yes so and work for ourselves 100 percent. so actually today we packed everything up we loaded the bus up and we are permanently now living in this beautiful bus full time now if you could just hurry up and get it finished <laughs> don't push your luck no it's been a battle we've been really yes. putting a lot of work in again and you know, it didn't seem like the last month we really did much. It really but didn't. then when you start to think about what all got done, it's like, oh man, yeah. we, were, we were working on it kind we of were, hard. Yeah, we were. We were so busy. yeah. Uh, so what's next? What's next? Well, short answer is we're going to a friend's house for the weekend mm -hmm. and then we are headed south. Yes, we are going to leave Colorado behind for now. Yeah, not forever. Not forever. It's a beautiful state. It and is. we appreciate everything that Colorado has offered us. Yes. And then we are heading south, which where are we going? We are going to go to the White Sand Dune or White Sand National Park. Yes. And I did say that correctly. It is now a national park. Uh it got put as a national park on December seventeenth of two thousand nineteen, I believe. Mm -hmm. So we will be some of the few first people to enjoy the White Sand National Park in New Mexico. Yes, which we're very excited about. First of all, it's a state that I was born in, so it has a piece of my heart. And there's still some areas that we haven't quite explored in New Mexico. So we're excited to head that direction. And of course, there's warmer weather, so you can't beat that. Sure, and then probably head to Arizona after that, but we shall see what comes up. There are some pretty big plans. Mm -hmm. We're just going to keep you filled in and that's some of what we want to talk about with you today. Yes. So one of our, our goals this year is Dustin and I obviously are going to travel around quite a bit and um, our goal is to keep you guys informed as to where we are going, kind of whereabouts, the directions that we're headed because we want to meet as many people as we can. We want to meet you. So if we are going to be in your area and you would love to. Or we are somewhere that you would like to visit. Yeah. Like don't be afraid to fly in or anything like that. Sure. Because we do have some really cool plans this year. We do. So if that is something, if you would like to meet up with us and we let you know whereabouts we're going, let us know. Yep. We would love to meet up see you know who you are face to face and just have a really good time commuting and communicating community <laughs> communicating. she wants a community yes and just getting to know all of you wonderful people yeah for sure this trips or these trips that like the two years that we've been traveling now every time we talk about our travels it's always the people are our favorite Yes. Whether it's a cool place that we're at or, or, or a crappy place that we're at, the people always make it what it is. So this year, it's we the people. And we the people join together this year, meet up, hang out, have all the times, experience all the experiences, and truly just become a family, become a community. Um, That's what it's all about. Yeah, whether you like our travels or you like right. our fitness or you like our couple stuff or you just like Tanya and I or you maybe if you just like one of us. Yeah. But yeah, if you want to hang out, if you want to meet up, if you want to get in on this, get in on this love that we are trying to spread this year, hit us up. Let us know. We would be more than happy so, to meet up. So, with that, the plan is to be at White Sands probably Wednesday of this week and you're about yes. to see this on sunday 
Yes, you're about to see this on Sunday. So three days from when you see this, we will be in New Mexico ish yeah. at the at the national park. Yeah, somewhere around there. So um and then after that we are going to Schooly Palooza. So if any of you are planning on joining and taking in the festivities let us know we would love yeah. to to meet up and hang out, hang out for be sure. there uh, we will be there but there's a lot of our followers and friends that live in arizona if you guys want to meet up let us know let's set something up because we plan on going basically from white sands tucson phoenix all the way across yes um time frame none Yep. Literally, we need to be there by January 20th for Schooly Palooza. Yep. And that's the plan. That is the plan. So we and got some days. It, and the rest of it, we'll let you know along the way. Yeah, and that's the one thing, like, we'll keep you updated. So, if you don't follow us personally on Facebook or Instagram, do so. Mm -hmm. If you don't follow Road Trip Adventure on Instagram or Facebook, do so. Uh, you can find me at the underscore Dustin Johnson. And I am at the Tanya Johnson. And Instagram? Yeah, that's on Instagram, mm -hmm. and then she is the Tanya Johnson on Facebook, and I think mine pops up as the Dustin Johnson. Sometimes it acts funny. Yeah, Anyways, we'll post it in the description below, so if you would like to follow us, you can find us there, and it's a lot if, easier. If you follow us individually, then you'll see a lot more of our stories, a lot more of our engagements. We don't do a ton on the Road Trip Adventure page just because we have a lot of things going on. Yep. And so we try to just kind of show the highlights on that page. Mm -hmm. So if you want to be like more inside or see where we're traveling or what we have going on, our we'll link, up, stuff, yeah, link up with us on our personal pages and let's, let's build a friendship. Let's build a following. Yes. Um, with that. With that, we have done, since we, are now living in the bus full time forever, <laughs> at least yeah, for now. For right now, that's the um, only plan. We have had to do some bus updates so that way everything is a little bit more functional for us. So let's talk about what we have done. So, so far we put a seat belt in for Tanya so that safety when we travel. Yes. We travel a lot, we drive a lot, and I know you guys think like, well, yeah, you travel all the time, but like we drive a lot in the next five days we'll drive 1200 miles yeah and so it's all just kind of a safety thing and it was something that we had set out for from the get-go we had a safety belt in the white bus but and we had not in this bus yep. um until just recently sure. so i'm very happy for that with that we also got pillows for our couch yes so now we have a nice little cozy backrest against the couch um it makes it feel a little bit more at home and then we got a stove with an oven. I'm so excited because it has been three years, two years. Two full years. Two full years since I've been able to cook in the oven. And it doesn't seem like much, but I'm we're very excited. We're excited. Very excited. Um, let me know what I should make. What's the first thing I should make in the oven? Yeah, get at us. Give me your thoughts. Uh, and I know we're like a little bougie and shit in our homemade school bus, but <laughs> we did stainless steel. We did. We did do stainless steel. Why wouldn't you? Yeah. Like, this is our home. Exactly. And some people look down at it like, well, why did you get that nice countertop? And it's like, well, turns out I live in here. Yeah, so this, this, is my house. this is my house. Right. Speaking so, of countertops. What? Countertops? Well, countertops? We got freaking countertops? We have countertops. So oh. we decided to go with butcher block. And we have actually two separate kind of countertops. Um, so we have the one where we have our sink and our stove. And then we have another counter space that is above our fridge. And what is cool about that one? It lifts up. Yes. So that we can then get into the fridge. Yep. Um, what else? Yeah. And then we got this really cool, because counter space is important to us. We meal prep. We love to eat. We love to cook. We love to use an oven since we have one. <laughs> um, but we also like to have people over. And yes, you can do that in a bus. Yes. Um, and we do have the setups for that. But we love to cook. We love to cook and we love to meal prep. Mm -hmm. So we have 
a countertop that goes over the top of our oven that makes our kitchen countertop as big as the oven as well. For sure. And it also has our logo cut into it. It is super cool. It is righteous. <laughs> and we've never seen anything like it. No. And we thank Preston at Bare Metal Fabrication for helping us make it when we were there. Yes. We just have Preston. not let the cat out of the bag on it yet. It's yeah. kind of one of them little hidden secrets that we are keeping. For sure. Um, and then we have a really big sink because since we meal prep a lot, we wanted a bigger sink so you're able to actually do some dishes. Yeah. Um, in our white bus, we had a little teeny tiny sink. They're called bar sinks. And it just doesn't cut it. Um, I don't like to have to be super careful with washing dishes and getting water all over. Um, and so this is going to be really fantastic for all of the dishes we'll have to do with all of the cooking and meal prepping. You meant to say all the dishes you will have to do. No, it's a, it's an us thing. Well, I do the cooking and the meal prep. No, I don't think so. Okay, I guess I lost that battle. Yes, you did. No, we help. We, we do all the chores together. We, we do, do everything together. We do do everything together. So, what else? I believe that's it. That's it. Um, But we just wanted to kind of get you up to speed with what is going on. So we're homeless? We're homeless. We're jobless. Kind of jobless. I mean, we work for ourselves, so. Yeah, and we have a bus. Yeah. But I think by standards, we're homeless, we're <laughs> jobless. And I'd be lying to you if I said we were fearless. We're a little nervous, we're a little scared, but we had to jump. It was time, yep. we feel good about it. Yeah. And here's to an entire year of badass shit. Full of adventure. So, um, since we are on the road, we look forward to providing you guys with more awesome content, videos. Again, if there's anything yeah. that you would like to see um, that we're doing or whatever it is, let us know. Fill us in on what it is that you want. Yeah. Um, and we'll How to to's or, yeah, whatever. For sure. But we do have some really cool features in this bus. We do. And we would love to help you if you need help with something. I know some people messaged us about getting help on the electrical. It actually really helped them with our video. Yeah. So if that's the case, if we're helping people, let us know what mm -hmm. we can do to help you. Yep. And we will keep rocking. For sure. So. If you guys like this video, please hit that thumbs up button, share some love in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe if you oh. haven't already, because... I thought we were doing the double thumb. <laughs> <laughs> and also hit that notification bell if you want to get notified every time that we drop new videos, which is every Sunday. Sometimes we do drop some videos during the week. We show some workouts or... Um, we haven't done any really yet, but you know, we can We're just getting cooking started. videos. Yep. Anyway, let us know. Um, thank yeah, you if guys. there's anything we can help you with living in a bus, living, like we've been Healthy li lifestyle. Yeah, two years now, living as a couple yeah. in a small ass space. <laughs> For sure. Yeah. Anything you guys need, let us know. Thank you guys so much. We love you and we will see you on Sunday. Spread love. <laughs>